girl Bone and we are back with another video today. I did my first ever try on haul in December. It was a J-Lux try on haul. If you haven't seen that as yet, then I'll link it in the description box below. But as you can see by the title, today I have a whole different haul. I got a whole lot of stuff from Pretty Little Thing. And this is actually a Black Friday haul. And look, um, I got it in January. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys everything that I got in that haul and we're going to be doing a modified version of Boyfriend Rates My Outfit because homie is behind the camera. <laughs> so you'll hear his voice behind the camera. That's not your voice. Oh, hi. <laughs> yeah, so he'll be, you know, giving his little critiques. So let's get right into it. I do have quite a few like different pieces. Actually, that's a lie. I have quite a few dresses and then two or three graphic tees. But anyway, you guys are going to see everything. So let's just get straight into the video. By the way, as you can tell, my hair is a little bit of a mess. Can you tell? Can you tell? Yeah. I can tell. On the camera. Oh, no. And I don't have any makeup on because honestly, I don't know people do these try and holes with makeup on like I'm not really trying to do these clothes before I wear it so yeah no I can use this huh whatever anyway so the first thing we started off hot right so the first thing is this nude strappy mesh ruched medoxy dress medoxy <laughs> in the size 8 As you can see it goes all the way down to like, well I don't know if you can see, can they see? All the way down to beneath my knee and it's quite fitted um, and even with the ruche it's still very fitted and it is a very stretchy dress so yeah. I've never ordered from Pretty Little Thing as I told you and I think most of their size is like UK which I'm really not too sure about um, so I was kind of cautious in my sizing so I'm hoping that everything that I chose actually fits me today. But what we what we saying, babe? What we saying? Uh, I think you could get a solid six point five out of ten. Oh my. I'm not a big fan of the kind of is that pleat? This, That's what you call it. The kind of pleat. This is the ruched part. Oh. The, this is ruched. Yeah, I think I'm not feeling that too much. Yeah, so my camera died, so <laughs> I was able to see myself. Uh, so I took my hair out because I think this looks a little bit better than what was going on just now. But anyway, back to your rating. You're giving this a 6.5? Yeah. I'm not a big fan of the... The, the uh, rouge. Yeah. It doesn't do you proper service. Really? Yeah. Really? There's no space to rouge on the butt. Okay, 6.5. Yeah. Alright, well. Let's let's see what's, what's the next stuff. So this is the next dress. This is the... Emerald green slinky ruched one shoulder long line midi dress in the size 10, a UK size 10. Alright, so honestly, I'm out of breath because the dry I just went through to put this dress on. There's this girl, Samara Maloney, she's a local content creator. She um, showed off this dress in, she's actually the reason that I did this whole haul because she's, I think, she's worked with them before. Anyway, so she had this dress on for the Christmas time and I really liked this dress and I asked her what size she wore and I think I went like A size up. I feel like I should have gone two sizes up because I mean, like how does it look? Like it's... To the toe. To the toe. Yes. <laughs> I have one no bra by the way and I feel like just because of how tight it is on me it's literally like seat belting me hey <laughs> other than that like it really snatches me in here like hair even snatches in my waist even like a lot like it's on but does it look like small tight 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 no that's good it looks good to you yeah I wouldn't know without really? you telling me this is the type of outfit, guys, the type of dress that I would put my makeup on after putting on a dress and take it off before taking off the dress. What do you guys think of it? Does it look like small, small, or does it just look fitted? Wait, what do you think? What What is this one's rating? You get a solid seven. Seven? A, a very solid seven, yes. Why? It holds all the curves. 
But I can tell that you're slightly uncomfortable. Why? Aside from the fact that I saw you fight to put it on. <laughs> I, I can look uncomfortable. I look uncomfortable. Yeah, I can sense you. I'm chilling. <laughs> Like all the hair, like I think it's. No, it looks great on you though. Way more rouged. It looks great on you though. Meanwhile, it's just like not ruching. It's like literal. So seven. Yeah. Okay, let's move. Actually, uh, seven. Take seven. the take the panel now. Seven point five. <laughs> yeah. Seven point five. Yeah, solid. Solid. Okay, great. So as I was trying to take off the dress, I pulled it up a little bit and I realized that it looks a little bit less tight. There's more ruching going on as I pulled it up. Like, can you see it? Like, I have some ruching on my belly, some more is going on here. Like, it doesn't look as like spread out. So maybe this is how I should wear the dress. Show up like this. What do you think? It. But it's still gonna be a tire to take off, so BRB. So the next dress is this cobalt print satin kimono dress, again in size 10. And here we go. It fits really well, I think, um, on my body. It's not too, it's like a yin, you know. What do you call these? On these sleeves. And it's still really like a drag the ground and i really really love the blue like i'm in love with the blue but you guys it goes all the way up to here <laughs> like this it's all the way up there is no coverage like to me this is like a vacation type dress because either that or i'll have to like get a seamstress to tack it right here because this, the, nope, <laughs> where am I going to look like this? No way. And if I walk, you can see every, you can see everything, everything, everything. So how do you feel about it? I mean, I really uh, do like it. It's just, I am in love. this part I have to finesse. I am in love with it. With what? This is surely a nine. A nine? It's easily a nine. Why? Because yeah. you have the whole rich. Rich. Uh, yeah, rich, rich, oh, rich, rich, rich. Yeah, you have the whole rich auntie vibe going on. Really? You're not old enough to be an auntie. I'm not kidding. But, yeah, you have it. You have it. This is giving you rich auntie vibes? Yeah. So, a nine. Nine. Where do you see me wearing I love the colour and I love the blender. Is that red and green? Yeah. Like yeah, red and green. I love it. Yeah. Where yes. do you see me wearing this? Brunch party. A party? A brunch party. What is this going on? Yeah, you, you just have to figure that out. Okay, and if I don't, and if I leave it like this, where am I going? I'll stand in front of you for the whole party. <laughs> <laughs> I like it, you know. It's just... Oh my gosh, did you see that? It's just um, this part. Anyway, we have three more dresses. So, BRB. So the next dress is this green print satin strappy cowl neck side garden midi dress again in the size UK 10. Now this size 10 feels a little bit bigger, more loose than the other size 10s that I tried on. Um, I also went quite out on a limb here with this dress. This is not the type of dress that I would have gone for and I cannot remember what it looked like on the model but it looked good enough for me to choose it. But right now that I have it, I'm not too sure how I feel about it. So where does it come down to like the back of my car? And again, we have some slit action going on here. Mm -hmm. um, but I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I feel really baggy down here. Like I don't know how I feel about this one. There's a mirror on this side. I've gone all the way to this part of the video to tell you guys that. But yeah, there's a mirror over here. Well, I love it. Really? Yes. <laughs> Why? It, uh, like, it accentuates your curves, it, but it still, it still, it okay, still yeah, hides it, it somewhat, you know, so. Like, what oh, is this? Okay, alright, I didn't see the back what before. 
<laughs> I did not see the back before. Uh, ooh, yes. <laughs> I feel like, uh, let me see back again. It's okay, I, I love the front, the back, I'm not so sure about it. Okay, so, so this one you have to be on You're back gonna... <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a real, this is a real dilemma. I really do love the front though. Uh, but the back is a killer. Uh, I'm gonna say 6.5. So the same as the first dress? Yes. So this one the first dress is on the same level? Yes. Wow, wow. Wow. Okay. Yeah. All right. So even gonna... even the side, like turn to your left, not that side. I like the other side. No. <laughs> even the side's not even yeah, the same. I like this. Is, yeah. Yeah. Six. Six yeah. point five. I'm gonna go into the last formal dressy dress that I have, and then we have one more after that, which is a casual juicy dress. And now we have the next dress, which is. The mustard asymmetric drape detail maxi dress again in the size UK 10. This I like this, you know. I like this. I went out, I stepped out again with this one. It's really formal, I think. It just needs a little iron press, you know. But I like this one. But the splits are just so out of control. Like, why is my hand all the way up here? A little tuck tuck, please. Please. I really like the color. I do like how tight, even though it's a little bit uncomfortable, I do like how tight it is around my ribcage here because it really like it's me. And then we have a nice little low back. You don't look like you like this one. I do actually. You do? Yeah. And it goes all the way down to the the floor. In the back seal. I feel like I agree with you on the tack thing. I wish you didn't say that because that kind of affected my judgment. What? The, a little seamstress action? Yeah, the thing about the tack in the front. That it needs a tack? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Anyhow, you look like a princess. Oh, princess? Yeah. Oh, I was going to say, I feel like with heels you would look even more... Goddess-like. Yeah. Like a... Yeah. Introducing. Yeah. You can even, like you can even, because your hair is just right, and you can even do like, what's the little thing around your crown, like the crown on your head? A, cr a, a crown? No, not a crown, like the tiny one. The one? A tiara? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> not even a tiara really, but something more Roman. Like a flower crown? Like yeah, a little maybe. flower thing? Not necessarily flowers, but yeah. Like vines. a little white. Something like vines. Yeah, yeah, I think I see what you're talking about. Oh gosh, I need to buy a steam model. Because I'm not ironing in this. <laughs> anyway, yeah. one, out of, one to ten. Out of ten. Yeah, it's a, it's a nine. Because you killed it. <laughs> you killed it. I just wish, yeah, what you said about the tack. Mm -hmm. Once that, yeah, that tiny spot is held down, you're like inside. Like it goes all the way up here. <laughs> you're inside. Once that little spot is held down. Nice, nice. Alright, so I'm gonna go into the last dress, which is a sweater dress. Not sweater dress, a jersey dress. Alright, so let's go. Alright, so the last, last, last dress is the basic nude short sleeve t shirt dress, again in size UK 10. I think I did a really great job choosing 10s across the board. The only thing that wasn't a 10 was the first dress that I tried on, which I guess was an 8. Yeah, that one was an 8. And I did choose, I chose an 8 because it's a really, according to the Website, I think it was a really stretchy material, so I just went down a size. Um, but yeah, so this is definitely my vibe. Like, there's nothing much to say about this one. It's literally just a t-shirt dress that you just throw on, going to run your real basic errands. She's not lying. This is her vibe. Literally my vibe, and it's long enough. Like it's short, but it's long enough, so I don't feel uncomfortable. You know. You can catch her wearing this on any given Tuesday. She's not <laughs> lying. Tuesday. Yeah. Why Tuesday? Because you didn't do that on a Monday. Why? Because it's Monday. Well, I would do this any day. How do you feel about this one? No I mind. do like it. I feel like... Uh, it's a really light material. It's too... Know? I feel like... It kind of gives me nighty vibes. A little bit. Just because of how thin it is. Oh, it's, <laughs> because it's, it's, it's extremely familiar. Uh-huh. 
I feel like that's that's pulling down slightly for me, but I'll give you a solid seven, a strong seven. Yeah. Now we're gonna go into the pieces, and the next thing that I would try on is this pants. Again, this is really out of my comfort zone because it's well. Let me tell you the name. It is the Stone Stretch Split Hem Skinny Trousers in the size eight, UK eight. I don't really know what size pants I am in the UK sizes. I did do some research, research meaning watching other people's pretty little thing hauls and hoping they had measurements in their description box. Um, but this pants it's like a split down by the heel. The waistband is really stretchy but there's not really any stretch in the actual leg and that's why I need the stretch. Like look at this. <sighs> Like, where is it gonna go? <laughs> oh, <sighs> I got it up. Wow, I got it up. Oh, but it doesn't do much for me. Like, yeah. pat a cake, pat a cake. Small does it. Like, where is the butt? <laughs> yeah, so we reviewed this one one time. This pants is a year. Like, where did the booty go? Where did the booty go? How would you? I mean, it's there. Like, you know? like, the booty is there. Do you think? I feel like if it did the bit. It's there. It's like it's squeezed up, but it's there. <laughs> and it doesn't even feel that squeezed, though. Like, I feel kind of comfortable. I just feel a little yeah. tight in the front here. But up here, I feel real comfortable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Come here, twelve. Do you see the, the splits? Two the twelve. Let me show them the splits at the bottom. Nah, it's 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 smaller in the bottom. <laughs> okay, so right. It looks great from the front though. Like, yeah. Yeah. So there's another picture pants and then I'll sell it. <laughs> but you still yeah. didn't give it a number. You could get you could get a seven. Seven? Yes. For seven. real? Yes. Why? Because I like what looks at the front. Really? Yeah, you look thick. Really? Let me see, give me a side on. But wait, you just said that the side looks smothered. Okay, do a side on anyway. <laughs> it's a six. <laughs> it's, it's a, yeah, it's a, oh, it's a six. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's a six every day of the week. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm going to put on two pieces and come back, right? Right, so the next two things that we have on, I bought, honestly, to go together. Um, but first, this is the white V plunge blouse in the size UK 8 and the snakeskin ruched tie with short in size UK 10. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, on the website, this pants, the model, had on a loose white blouse that went with it with the same kind of vibe. It wasn't this, I don't think it was this exact top, but I said, okay, great. This is me, this is what I want. So I bought the two of them. So let's talk about it separately. I love, actually, I just love both of the pieces anyway. A few, yes, I am, yes, I am. Try hiding, I'm hiding, right? Um, this pants is a really, really stretchy pants. Like, I'm in love with the, how this feels. Um, elastic waistband, the pants itself is stretchy. Then there's the tie um, waist. What do you call this? The tie. The tie. And then even at the top here, it still gives you that little frilled look. I don't know if you could see it. There's room for your butt, but... Yeah, like, I like pants like these. Like, I always like to hair, okay? But I don't like the fit of it when it's down here. Like, I like a high-waisted look, especially when it's a little bit of a shorter. But then with the blouse, the blouse is a really nice material. Like, it's light, but still thick and I like it there's no button here but I would probably add some double-sided tape somewhere other than that it's just open to the wind like you guys could just you could just see inside of here and I'll have to figure out again I'll probably just use some nipple covers but yeah this is how it looks on the outside the shirt I really do like the material of the shirt you know so you said yes sir yes to everything to everything yes and how do you feel in regards to numbers Yes. <laughs> oh, I give you a nine point yes. So is that a ten? No, it's a nine point two. It's higher than a nine. 
Sorry, I don't know nine. You got a nine point yes. Don't look at me like that. A nine point yes? Yeah, don't look at me like that. Yeah, but I really do like these two. It's just again to figure out the little clothing thingies with the these things. So now we're gonna go into some basics. I have three more things to show you guys. Two basic graphic tees and a cardigan. So BRB. Yeah, so this is the first graphic tee. I just really wanted some graphic tees since the third one. So I got two. This is the first one and this is the white Mean Girls Wear Pink. Oh, Mean Girls Wear Pink <laughs> slogan in the size. This is a UK medium. I don't think that I expected it to be this big. It's huge. You can do this little thing people do, which I don't know, like people do it and they look good, but I feel like so dumb when I do this. Like how does this look to you? People feel dumb when they no, do this. I feel dumb when I do this, but people look cool doing it. Yeah. And they just tuck it in here. <laughs> I mean, you don't really have to raise this up because it's a piece of but like, that's dumb. <laughs> Don't answer that, but anyway, <laughs> can you see your print? So that's what it says oh, on Wednesdays. We wear pink, yeah. It says that, yeah. So, this is the baby pink and bloom printed t shirts in size medium, UK medium. Does this look like the UK medium that I just took off? No, it doesn't. I'm so confused, but this I think this is the vibe I was going for for the other two days. But again, it's another basic graphic tee. This is the joy. I, I don't even know what this means. You know? And it's pink, so I think it's cute. It is cute. Yeah, and I prefer the size over that bedtime jersey. But anyway, so this is the last, like, outerwear. Oh, that's a lie. <laughs> I have this whole cardigan, and this is the light gray maxi knitted cardigan in a size UK 8. And I felt like I just wanted this to be like snuggly and comfy. And that's exactly what it is. And I like that it's so long. Does it not have pockets? Oh my gosh. I thought it had pockets. It doesn't have pockets. What am I supposed to do with my hands? Not me. I, can't, I actually wish I got a size a little bit bigger. But this is still comfortable. So this is me. Like traveling throughout the airport. I don't know. Anyway, so this is the last like piece piece. I did buy two swimsuits that I'm not going to show you guys on YouTube, but you know what you could do? You could follow me on Instagram because most likely the two swimsuits, once they fit me good, are going to be on my Instagram. Let me just take them out the packaging. Oh, I lied. I have one more juicy. Ah. This is the black tie dye red t shirt again in a medium UK size. That looks really small. Like, we literally just went up in, in sizes, <laughs> even though it's the same size. I'm gonna put it on. <laughs> Y'all. So, we just saw three variations of the UK medium in this one video. But I did think, I do think that this looks like a crop top on the side. So, I'm not really surprised that this is how it fits. Actually, I think this is. This is what it was supposed to be. But like, did you see what happened? Eh? I tried on three UK medium jerseys and had three different experiences. Anyway, again, this is a really basic jersey. Something that I would just throw on with a pair of jeans to go to the mall or go and do whatever. It's just something that has a little bit more character than the basic jersey that I have at home. So that's why I got this one. So now, I'll show you guys these swimsuits. This one is a whole piece, a black whole piece, and it is the black asymmetric double strap swimsuit. Oh, this is a size 10. Oh, this looks like it's gonna be. This looks huge, huh? Mm -hmm. It looks a little bit huge. Oh, yeah, yeah, no. no. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so. And then the next thing is this two-piece. This is the brown, well, the top is the brown padded tie, one shoulder bikini top. And then the bottom is the brown high-waist bikini bottom. Um, and I got both of them in size UK8. This looks like it'll fit. Nice. And then it's just the top. Hopefully the top would fit because I don't think that there is um, anything for me to 
tight enough the top for this the top again there should be a picture on the screen that you guys would have seen and once everything fits well then you will see it on my instagram so make sure to follow me on instagram and await those pictures but for now that is it for the end of this pretty little thing haul comment down below which piece was your favorite piece which one was your worst not most liked Peace. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.